guys and welcome back. In this video of the Supplement Simplified series, I'll be talking to you about theobromine, which you may also see on ingredient labels as L-theobromine. Now before I get started, I want to point out that I'm not going to get too deep into the science behind each ingredient, and if you do want more references, please see the description below for any references that I used. Also a link to my website, johnmarkerfitness.com, with a more in-depth review of theobromine itself. Theobromine is similar to caffeine, except for the fact that theobromine has three methyl groups instead of two methyl groups. If you want to know more information about those, look at the description below. I also talk about that in my previous Supplement Simplified video. Theobromine actually doesn't contain any bromine, uh, regardless of the name containing bromine itself. Natural sources include chocolate, leaves from the tea plant, as well as the cola nut. One ounce of milk chocolate contains about 60 milligrams of theobromine, while one ounce of dark chocolate contains about 200 milligrams. Now what does theobromine do? It has an effect similar to that of caffeine, but less intense. It is a vasodilator, which means that it will widen your blood vessels and increase the amount of oxygen that is able to flow through and arrive at your muscles. It's also a diuretic, similar to dandelion root, uh, which will help release water from your system, also known as a urination aid. Theobromine does have a lesser impact on the central nervous system than caffeine does. However, it does have a greater stimulant effect on the heart. But lastly, theobromine lasts longer than the effect that caffeine has on the human body. In some studies, theobromine in doses of 800 to 1500 milligrams per day caused sweating, trembling, and headaches. However, at doses of 250 milligrams and less, there were only slight effects to mood, and anything above 250, we began to see some negative effects on mood. So most of your pre-workouts that you will see have around 200 to 300 milligrams of theobromine in them if they choose to use this at all. If you guys like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos, and click the notification bell to receive updates each time I upload. Upcoming videos will include recipes, product reviews, more supplement simplified videos, and other fitness and workout related content. Make sure you comment below with other ingredients you may want me to review in the future. And thanks again for watching guys, and we'll see you on the next video.